What's up, I'm Sarkis, and welcome to Home Theatre Tours episode number four. In these types of series, I feature some of the best theatres I think need checking out and give you guys some ideas and inspiration for your own home theatre room. If you see anything you'll like, I'll have everything listed for you in the description box so you can check it out, show some love and comment your thoughts or if you have any questions about this video. If you like home theatre, PC and general tech content, Hit that subscribe button to be notified on my upcoming videos and if you want your room to be featured make sure you hang around until the end of the video now this room is a unique home theater man cave collector's cave all-in-one and I'm sure some of you guys are really going to enjoy this tour so let's get to it This awesome room belongs to Mitchell from River, Minnesota, United States. Mitchell bought his house in 2016 and one of his conditions was to have a place where he could set up his collection and home theater man cave. Dealing with WAF wife acceptance factor, he split the basement of his house into two, one for the man cave and one for the better half, the girl cave. Well played Mitchell, well played. So let's start off with his home theater setup. This cozy room is temporally wired for a complete 7.5.4 surround sound system, but has a major upgrade plans to 7.5.6 system. For this place, we have the 75 inch Samsung MU8000 4K TV featuring HDR1000 with 240 motion rate. But that's not all, with the touch of a button, his screen expands from 75 inch to a monster 120 inch motorized eGalaxy tap tension screen. Wow Z, that's awesome. Moving on to the surround sound in this room is massively impressive. For the front left and right channel, we have the famous Klipsch R28F floor standing speakers that looks amazing in this room and of course the perfect combo for these towers is the Klipsch RP404C center speaker. This beast takes movies and music to a whole new level. For surround and re-surround channels, Mitchell has chosen these specific speakers because of its size and flexibility of hanging them on the ceiling and they are the Klipsch R51M bookshelf speakers. As I said before, this system is a 7.5.4 setup but is wired and ready for a 7.5.6. So the 0.4 being changed to 0.6 means this room has not four but six Klipsch RIC65 Dolby Atmos speakers. For a room this size, it's beyond crazy. I know it's a little extreme, but you haven't seen nothing yet. Check these out. To complete his surround setup, Mitchell thought, why not go big or go home? So he's hooked up two Klipsch R120SW subwoofers in the front of the room, and three more subwoofers behind his seating, which are two Klipsch SW350 and the Paradigm 250 watt sub. That's over 1500 watts of bass. Now before we jump into what's powering this setup, I want to show you guys this amazing collection Mitchell has in this room. Being a massive football fan, he has all 32 NFL team helmets, with 19 of them autographed by NFL players, including players from Joe Montana, Lawrence Taylor, John Elway, Peter Manning, and many more. There is also eight autographed NFL footballs and eight autographed NFL jerseys. This one's my favorite, autographed Mike Tyson boxing gloves. That is awesome. If you guys want to ask Mitchell anything about his phenomenal collection, shoot a comment down below. Let's take a look at the beautiful, amazing rack he's got. Uh, <laughs> whoops, <laughs> excuse my language, ladies. I mean the AV rack. Starting from the top, we have the Pioneer Elite VSX LX503 receiver to power some of his speakers and consoles. Moving down is the AMC 2445 amplifier and Panasonic DMP UB 904K player for his 4K streaming 
and hard disk content. Now we have four Emotiva amplifiers here, the XPA3 5 channel, UPA500, A300 and the UPA200 with two infinity fans in between for some cooling. Right under we have the Wii console and the PS4 Pro for some gaming. Feeding some clean juice, he's using the Panamax M5300 power conditioner. This thing's awesome, I definitely need one of these in my room. Then we have the Xbox One X and last but not least on the bottom he has three monster power conditioners. Wow, that is one impressive expensive AV rack. Mitchell, I like your style man. On the side table of his seating area he also has some cool Xbox, PS4 and Wii controllers for some family gaming time. This room is also controlled with Google Home Assistant and the Logitech Harmony 650 Universal Control for easy control function. Now I like to leave the projectors last on the list and for the motorized screen that you guys saw before he's using the Epson 3500 3 LCD 3D projector which has an amazing three times brighter color than competitive models and works really well for his 3D movies. The decor as you guys can see in the room there is a lot happening. On the side he also has a nice CD rack for his movies and plenty more things to show around the room but let's keep this video nice and short but honestly guys for me this is the ultimate gaming movies music collector's man cave that i'm sure a lot of you guys will appreciate if you like anything or want to ask mitchell anything make sure you comment and i'm sure he'd love to help you guys out let me know what you guys think of this amazing home theater setup in the comment section below i'm sure mitch would love to connect with people that appreciate his setup now there is a lot of work and love gone into his room so make sure you show some love back. I finally also have my merchandise store up and running so check that out. If you'd like your room to be featured on this channel be sure to shoot me a comment, email, tweet or send me a message on Instagram or Facebook and I'll be in touch. If you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Got heaps of awesome videos lined up for you. Also check out the HStudio 3.0 Discord channel which I'll put the link in the description box where we all come together, talk about and discuss things like tech, home theater, workout tips, food, etc. Because life isn't just about tech. Take care, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.